Hello guys, welcome back to this channel. Hope everyone is fine. On that note, let's start this video. So this is week one assignment of the course data mining. Guys, for the past five years, we have been providing solutions for various NPTEL courses. So for data mining also we have provided in the past. So we want to continue that. So these are completely our probable solutions guys. If there are any changes that come to our notice, definitely we'll update that in the comment section. So please check the comment section before the final submission and if you can also suggest me the changes if you want if you are believing the changes should be the cha uh, change should be changed so you can do that in the comment section as well so please watch the video till the end guys do subscribe our channel definitely like the video guys then only our videos will appear in suggestions for other students as well and please support our channel so that we can get more encouragement to upload further weeks as well so let's see the first question Data mining is the process of finding valid, novel, useful and what type of patterns in large volume of data. Which of the following terms best fills the gap above? So for first question the answer is option C guys actionable. It is option C actionable. Right. Next moving on to the second question guys. Which of the following is usually the last step in the data mining process? So for second question, option D, deployment. Deployment is the probable solution for second question. Next, moving on to the third one. Name of a movie can be considered as an attribute of what type? So it can be considered as option A nominal it is nominal type right next fourth question guys user rating given to a movie in a scale 1 to 10 can be considered as an attribute of what type so the answer is option B ordinal Next fifth question. Which of the following operations cannot be performed on interval attributes? So for fifth question the probable answer is option D multiplication. Option D multiplication. Next sixth question. So before moving into the sixth question, I want to make a small announcement guys. So that is regarding exam preparation MCQs. So for the course data mining, we have collected the past NPTEL assignment questions. So these are the mixture of past and our own handmade questions guys, completely purely, purely based on NPTEL syllabus. So with five years of NPTEL experience, we have prepared this. So here you are going to get a hu huge number of 150 MCQs in a Google Drive PDF restricted link. So for one person it is 150 rupees guys for five persons combinedly you can get it for 500 so you can share for just 100 rupees per each person if you take in a bulk right so please ask your friends share them this video so ask them to join in the group so one person from the group mail us to this email id guys bk179417 at the rate gmail.com so mail 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 us to the this mail id and you can take the pack guys combinedly for the group so each person will get 150 mcqs guys so the combinedly you have to pay 500 so if you are only one person you can pay 150 rupees guys so this is the mail id bk179417 at the rate gmail.com so if you are if you are confirmed to make the payment then only mail us guys so this is the mail id and if you want only 100 plus mcq I mean only 60 plus mcqs this is just a sample pack it available in video format but whereas the 150 mcqs will be google drive pdf restricted link whereas this is youtube membership guys you have to join our youtube as a member with just 89 rupees so that you can get 60 plus mcqs so it is only for one person and for one month whereas this 150 mcqs pack will be till the exam results day res results publishing day the access will be valid guys so if you want only youtube membership of sample of 60 plus mcqs no need to mail us you can directly go to our youtube channel page so eskumar edu 
so this is our channel page it will be like this with this logo so beside the subscribe button there is a join button right so click on this join button then a window will appear like this so select the second one videos only for members 89 per month pack and again click on this blue color join button filling the form and directly make payment to youtube only guys not to us that's it you will become member of our channel and you can get access to all of our members only videos here you can see we have uploaded we have uploaded many videos on many subjects you can get all these videos for the same 89 rupees guys no extra charge needed you can get similarly we have uploaded data mining video as well so you can get all that videos for that same 89 rupees no extra charge needed guys but if you are preparing for the final exam point of view my suggestion is it's better to take this data mining 150 mcqs google drive pdf pack because it is easy to search any question you want search option enabled and syllabus maximum amount of syllabus topics are included next uh, it is completely giving you the access till the exam results day guys so my suggestion is it's better to take this 150 mcq spec but if you want to try the sample pack of 60 plus mcqs you can go with 89 per person video format by joining the channel so that's it guys now let's get back to the solutions but if you want the pdf pack then you have to mail me to this email id so let's in move into the questions guys sixth question which of the following operations can be performed on ratio attributes so for sixth question the probable answer is option c guys both of the above that means addition and multiplication next seventh question sales database of items in a supermarket can be considered as an example of what so for seventh question the probable solution is first option record data it is record data next eighth question rows of a data matrix storing record data usually represents what so it represents option b objects guys it represents objects next ninth one which of the following is an example of continuous attribute so it is option a weight of a person it is a continu continuous attribute example next tenth question if a record data matrix has reduced number of columns after a transformation the transformation has performed what so it is dimensionality reduction and moving on to the final question of the assignment that is 11th one if a re record data matrix has reduced number of rows after a transformation the transformation has performed what so the answer is option a guys data sampling so friends these are the solutions for week one assignment of the course data mining so hope this video helpful for you if you feel the same please subscribe our channel like this video and definitely share this news with your friends and classmates and don't forget to purchase this 150 mcqs google drive pdf package for one person it is 150 for five persons combinedly 500 rupees guys so this is the mail id bk179 479 at gmail.com if you want to purchase only the youtube membership sample mcqs 60 plus mcqs you can directly join our channel so that's it guys for this video. So keep supporting us like this. So until the next video, goodbye. Thank you.